What's up? So quick video. In this one, I'm going to be showing you how you can set up and connect your trading account to my FX book so that you can better track progress of your trading and so others can view your progress as well. Let's go. Welcome back. My name is Sergio. My channel's name is Surge Tech, and my goal is to help bring you clarity in your trading and help you become consistently profitable. So if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe, hit the bell so you get notified when I release new videos like this. And I'm going to have useful links down below in the description of this video. So don't forget to check that out. All right, let's jump right into it. So I'm going to show you in my computer here how you can easily connect your trading account, MetaTrader 4, MetaTrader 5 to my FX book so that you can better track your progress and so others can track your progress as well. Let's go. So go over to myfxbook.com. You're going to select portfolio at the top and add account. Once you're here and add account, you're going to select once again, add account. And here you're going to select MetaTrader 4 auto update or MetaTrader 5 auto update, depending on what platform you use to trade. Then you're going to go ahead and enter all of this information here. So you're first, you're going to select an account name. You're going to select a broker name, the server of the broker which they're going to give you all that information when you create the account, the account number, the investor password, and uh, for account name, you can choose whatever account name you prefer to your liking so that you can keep your portfolio accounts organized. Once you have it all filled out, go ahead and select create account. Give it a few seconds while it connects to your trading account. And then you should get this message. Your account was successfully processed. Here you can go to take me to my account or set privacy settings. So let's go to set privacy settings because you're going to need uh, to update some information here in order to verify your account. So this is the information we're going to use. Here you can edit your account information. Here is where you will set your permissions. So since your account is not verified, it will be only private. Uh, the, the only way to make it public so that others can see your account is you have to fully verify this account. And I'm going to show you how to do that next. They also give you instructions here to, to set it up yourself, but I will walk you through it in this video. So this is how your account will look like since it's connected. As you can see, it says track record verified at the top there, but under it, it says trading privileges not verified. And that will change once you fully verify the account. So since your account is private, you won't be able to share the link until you verify it, like I mentioned. So uh, here it will give you, it will tell you that, uh, and it will tell you to go to settings if you want to uh, verify your account. So let's go ahead and show you how to do that now. So go back to accounts at the top toolbar, go to uh, select your account and hit edit, and then go to verification. And this is the information that we're going to use to fully verify the account. So you're going to have to open up your, tr your MetaTrader 4 or 5. You're going to go to Tools, Options. Here in Options, uh, you're going to go to where it says Server, and here will, it will give you the information of your broker. Uh, here you're going to select where it says Change. Okay, once you select that, it's going to ask you to put in the master password where it says Current Password. But you're going to go ahead and select Change Investor Password. Uh, so you're going to select change investor password. You're still going to have to enter your current uh, master password. And where it says new password, you're going to enter that authorization password that my effects book gave you. And then you're going to enter once again, where it says confirm. Once you're done, hit OK. OK, and then once you do that, you're good to go. Go ahead and select OK once again on, uh, on your MetaTrader. OK, and then uh, we're going to go back to my effects book. Once you're back at my effects book, go ahead and hit update password. And then you're going to go ahead and type in that authorization password that you see there. Just type it in uh, where it says investor password. And once it's fully typed in, go ahead and hit OK. It's going to say password changed successfully. Go ahead and hit close. Then go ahead and select connect. It's going to say connecting to your account. So after a few seconds, it will say account authorized successfully. Once you see that, you're good to go. Go ahead and hit save. And now if you select your account, you will see that now it says track record verified and trading privileges verified. So now we can go ahead and go back into the account so that we can 
make it public so that we can share the link and everyone can see it as well. So let's go back into the settings. Here you will go to uh, accounts, go ahead and select edit, and we're gonna go to permissions. Here in permissions, we're just gonna set all the tabs to public. The only one I will not set to public is the account number because that's not really needed. So set everything to public. And once all of them are selected, hit save. And now if you select your accounts, you will see that it will say public. So now you will be able to share your link with others on your websites and everyone will be able to reach your MyFXBook page and keep track of your account trading stats. So that is how you connect your trading account to my FX book. So go ahead and smash that like button. If this video was helpful for you, comment down below and let me know what type of videos you want to see next from me. And that's all I got for this video. I'll catch you in the next one. And as always, peace. Thank you.